Thumbs up, ladies and gentlemen. Begin in three, two, one, go! Our qualification match is underway. Big things expected from the Blue Alliance. We're seeing Ironclad able to get all three of their preloaded power cells into the outer ports. Chicago style bot dogs trying to get a few of their own. Driver control period underway. Drive seems now with full control of their robots. Two minutes in the match, plenty of time for big moves to be made. Blue Alliance with the initial lead, 37 to 27, able to score six power spells and autonomous. Ironclad is back for more. Three of their shots are too wide, but two make it right where they need to go for four points from the outer ports. On the Red Alliance, we're seeing Caxies trying to score. They're grabbing power cells and look to be shooting from the Red Alliance trench. Also trying to make aerial shots for the Red Alliance is Rockford Robotics. It looks like Seabot's trying to figure out the best way they can contribute to their alliance. They're trying to grab power cells off the ground, but not clear what their purpose will be. On the Blue Alliance, we're seeing quarter bots come in for shots. Two shots unsuccessful. They need to go back and try again, but plenty of power cells on the ground for them to choose from. Ironclad is back for more. With these shots, Blue Alliance able to activate stage one. They can now move on to stage two of activating their shield generator. 45 seconds remaining in the match. Blue in the lead, 48 to 30. Red Alliance definitely still in the match. It's going to come down to end game scoring for an alliance to seal the deal when it comes to the score. And speaking of end game, there goes our siren. It looks like the Blue Alliance gonna be attempting a triple hang. We're seeing Chicago style bot dogs on one side of the switch, Porter bots on the other, ironclad in the middle. They've got 17 seconds to make it happen. Over on the Red Alliance, Caxi straddling the middle. Porter bots there are not gonna be climbing today. Their claw falls to the ground. They're backing away though to make sure that they are not supporting Ironclad. A smart move by the Blue Alliance. Very close and difficult to see if Caxi's is off the ground. They Alliance. With a very close final score of 78 to 75, the Blue Alliance takes home the win, and Ironclad and the Chicago-style Botnogs will be staying in our top four ring.